Hello and welcome back to Garen Reaver vs Slime Rancher Day 94. So last time we learnt Cacti are sticky. I don't really know what to make of that, it's just a fact. Oh no, he's about to, yep. Yeah, I don't know really I don't really know what to make of that. That's just sort of a thing that's in this game, I guess. Wow, dervish mosaics look beautiful. Look at that. Look at the spinny thing. Oh. Alright, I get the mosaics are growing on me. I really wasn't sure about them at first with their little membranes, but no, they they are growing on me. Okay, I'm having trouble finding the dervish gordo. But I know I can find it easily by going through there and then back through here and then going the direction I didn't go last time. So I think I go this way. Yeah, back past the dancing machines. And I think it's like up there. Yeah, there it is. There he is. I'm going to leave them dancing for now. I don't really need their stuff and I'm full of chickens, so... I wonder if this one will be a teleporter or a key. Presumably the two new Gordos in the old areas are to give you keys so that you can open the uh, sort of locked doors in here to get to the, to the oases. What's that? Oh, that's a Tangle one. Okay, so the Tangle ones are here. Hello! I have a load of pogo fruit that I may as well give you. 39 of them is how much I had. I don't know how many I need. More than 39, good to know. Well, thanks for your cooperation, I'll be back later. Hey man. I brought you loads and loads of chickens. Can you call your minions off me please? No? Okay, bye bye. Anyone else? Bye bye. Anyone else? Yep, they're chucking themselves in. Nope. Bye bye. Stop it. Stop it. Ugh, I think more of spawning Ryan's gonna have to feed him. Right, I'll start with the least valuable ones. These ones are a bit more exotic. And then these ones are the most common ones I have. Yeah, look at those eyes! Boom! A key! Well, I was right about the key for that being... Yeah, the, that one being a key. Alright, there you go, hunters. Oh my god! That was the most horrifying thing I've ever seen. Bloody hell. Okay, yeah, they are demonic. They are truly demonic. And not the good kind of demonic either. The evil, creepy kind. I've realised the sensible way of doing this. Instead of having silver parsnips in that, that should be my pogo fruit storage because that also connects to the incinerator. So I keep a few pogo fruit in there for incineration purposes and then I can keep spare silver parsnips in there. So that means I can grow the silver parsnips and everything has space. So you guys, you get some silver parsnips. And the others go to the ones up in the lab. Oh! Oh, there's a pod! I would never have seen that if I wasn't taking this shortcut back to the uh, teleport. I'm on Ring Island at the moment. I was here looking for veggies so I can go pop the Crystal Gordo, and I found this. Ugh. Oh, it's a lava dust. At least that's rare. Let's see, most of my guys are happy, and I still need to sleep to get this, and I kind of want to wait for stuff to grow. So I'm going to go sleep for the rest of the day and that'll sort of give me some more to do because I'm just sort of wondering about not doing anything. 
Okay. Yeah! Achievement! Hi! That's an achievement, getting a him. Cool. Right, so now I can go feed everyone. Is everyone hungry? Yes, everyone's hungry. Right. Back to work then. Huh. Oh, it's a strange diamond. Bloody hell. I was just thinking, why on earth... Oh yeah, raw jelly, good. I was just thinking, why on earth is there a glass shard here? But it's like, nope, that's, uh... That's the other one. Which means I can now make... Refinery Link. So that's my only jelly, but I will put that in the, um... Desert with those fabricate uh, extractors, sorry. With those extractors, and that means I won't ever have to ferry stuff back. That's the real problem of sleeping. Like, half of my crops have just vanished. Because apparently they died while I was asleep and all of the stuff despawned. That's really irritating. On the plus side, I mean, these guys are really awkward to keep. But let's see, I'm at 39,000 and I'm about to sell almost two full loads of this. Almost 10 grand from just that. That is not bad for a single sort of corral. I think that's all of the this round of plots. So I'm at 55,000. I need 32 and a half for that. Isn't that the same as the one I just paid? Wasn't that one 32 and a half? I think it was. Well, the next one's 40,000. I'm about halfway there. Slime Trophy 2. Maybe they'll uh, fix the damage on this one then. So, some new colours. Ah, oh, damn, I think it's Salamandra and Royalton. I didn't even look. I, th I recognise Eventide. I'll, I'll just put it on just in case. Uh. Mm, the purple slime's nice, but the rest, now. Nah. That one's not too bad, but it still doesn't beat the Cobalts. The blue, the white, and the gold. It just works so well. So, I was collecting vegetables to go and pop a crystal gordo. Uh, do I have enough to spare? I really don't. Well, I've been carrying around these carrots for like a day or two now, so I should pr probably go and use them. I'm just going to go see if there are any more ochre ochres here, because I think this crop is ready by now. No, I fed it to them immediately, so that's not there. Okay. Uh, quarry. I'm fairly sure this will not be enough, because the other one took like 40 or 50. But this is just to get you started. Yeah, not even slightly enough. That's just to get you started so that I can uh, get them out of my pack. Oh! Oh, I haven't seen this one. Hello, Beatrix. My name's Hobston... Twilgers, rancher explorer and the former owner of this here ranch you now call your own. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I was a rancher for many years than I can remember and felt there was one last adventure left in me so I set off to find just that. But before I go I'm taking one last tour around this here land I love. So keep your peepers peeled for notes like these if you want to hear what an old coos has to say. So if this is their first communication, how the hell does she buy this off him? How the hell does he know sh who she is? I suppose it could be like through an estate agent or something, but still. So where's the other thing going to go? Is that going to go over there? Or is it going to go on this side? I don't know where the next trophy is going to go. Hey, oh, I'm back. Have some more. Brought some heartbeats because I want to pop you. And although they are quite valuable, eh, I can grab them back. Oh, a key. Key in a hole. Oh, I looked up and I saw that, and it's like, oh, that's just the sky. That's just, like, the night sky. But it wasn't. I think that's all I can do here. If I take, if I fill up on pogos and then go see if I can pop this dervish one, which I was about to try. Oh, yeah, and then I ran out of fruit very quickly. So it's already had some. It is this one. Ooh, it's already had some. And as I'm heading in this direction, yeah, they're dancing good. 
I'll put this over here. Uh, refinery link. And get all of these dancing again. Uh, undancing again, rather. Hello. Have a load of pogo fruit. Oh, that did not take much. Oh, a slime key. I guess he, has, he is close to the, uh, the original teleporter, isn't he? Nah. Yeah, I'll grab them. And one glitched into the wall. And then the last one. Nah, nothing. Alright, well that's another Gordo popped. Oh, there's a pod there. Nice and easy to reach. And it has... Potted Tactus, a, ta a cactus found in the glass desert that slimes and other items can stick to for a short while. Cool. Oh, what's this up here? There's something in there. Because this is the ruin I saw and never quite got into. Oh, it's a font. Hmm. Well, they look like puddle ones. How do I get up there? Do I have to go around? Nope. Aha, down there. Tangles. These are the tangle ones. Let's have a quick look on top. Yeah, there's another tangle one there. So there's two. Third one will be around us somewhere. Alright, so I need to go get some tangle plots. I should have tons because, well, I should have enough. I only need three. And it is, oh, dropping out. This way. Tangle one. Oh, it loses its flower when it's put in that. It's a shame. Tangle two. And I know where the third one is. And tangle three. Fantastic. So now... Oh, that's still closed. Oh, well. So now I have a font here. So I saw one sort of round here. Got 30 seconds. Uh, down there. Got it! Ah. Oh, lovely. Uh, where are the other ones? I can't think of where I've seen other ones around here. Because this is right near the entrance. So there must be more around here. Well, there's one for a start. That one's really easy. Hop up here and snipe it. Snipe it. Nice. Can I get a second one in the same water batch? I think there's one just down here, isn't there? Ah, no, I thought there was. Might be that one I'm thinking of. Oh, there is. Damn it. Boom. Cool. wonder if something particular happens if you regrow them all. Hmm. Oh, hello. Right over one of these that I've already got. Master Apiary? Nine cycles? I didn't know they were in yet. Bloody hell. Nice. So presumably I've got to find the others in these as well. So that means there are, what, probably two more uh, tier three crackers? Uh, core, treasure cores? What's that there? Oh, it's a statue that wants a, pl uh, a plot. What kind of statue? I have been over this way before, so I should know. Oh, it's the mosaic. Of course. That might be the last one, unless there's another one through the mosaic um, 
like being hidden by the mosaic Gordo, because I don't know what's behind him. I assume there's a bit area, uh, a bit that I've not explored, you know, an area I've not explored past him, but I'm not 100% sure. Might just be a shortcut. I'll be a bit disappointed if it is just a shortcut. Considering I've, you know, explored quite a bit and I've not found the back of him. That makes me think it's a new area. Eat that, please. No, you... Oh. One of the mosaic to eat it. I want three mosaic plots. I don't really need this stuff on me. It's not really valuable enough to take up inventory space. Yeah, there's one. One. Wait for it. Come back. Two. One more. Hey, eat this. Oh, damn it, you're... Oh, eat, eat a pogo fruit. Yeah, nice. Three. Cool. Uh, where was it? Well, there's the mosaic gordo again. I probably could fly over, but I don't want to ruin it. You know, I, I don't want to to ruin the surprise of what's behind him, because he's blocking a door. He's definitely blocking a doorway. But I don't want to ruin if it is a new area or if it is just a shortcut. I'd rather just sort of wait and have him as the last... Ooh, the last one I pop. And this place is still utterly huge, by the way. There we are. Right, I found my way back at last. Didn't recognise it from you know, coming, coming at it from that angle. Right, so, three mosaics. There's one. And there's two. And there's... Oh, no! Oh, whew. One of these, they actually rotated slightly in a patch. Yes. Because it was too difficult to hit. I'm going to guess it was the top one. Although it could have been the lower one. Right, where's the actual font? I keep calling it a font, because that's just what it reminds me of, you know, like a font in a church. I really like the music when it gets all creepy, it's like... Din, 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 din. It's nice. Where's the bloody font? Oh, was it down here? Yes. Okay, how do I get back up? That makes the 30 seconds a bit harder. Because usually they're high up, so you have to sort of drop down to places. Ooh. No, I can't get another one. It's lost. Ooh. Hello! Everyone just pile on. Wow, lots of you. Hey guys, welcome. Ah, oh, there's the next one. Is there another way up? No, it's the only way up. Right, let's give this another go. Try going this way. Nope, there is only one way out. Wasted 10 seconds. But this one is just straight through here. Is that the only, only other one here? I think it is. Oh, so nice. Hi, what are you doing here all alone? You're right. <gasps> Is it okay? It's got to be okay. This has got to be part of... It's got to be natural for it, surely. You know, if it's not something I did to it, then it's probably perfectly fine for it. Because, you know, firestorms don't last forever, so logically, yeah, they would be okay when they ended. Presumably they just sort of lose the strength to keep their form. You know, they, they don't have the heat that comes from the, uh, from the storm or from lying in a trough of ash. Then presumably they, they do just sort of pop again, but they are still okay. It didn't... Oh! What happened? I ran out of boost. It is okay. It didn't die or something. So don't don't worry. I'm fairly sure it's okay. What I don't know, though, is if slimes are okay if they fall into the desert. No! 
Or scratch my nose. I don't know if they're okay if they fall in there. I assume they are. Because it's a bit like the slime sea, but sandier. But I really don't know for sure. So I'd rather not risk it. And if I see a tabby falling in, that will count as underprivileged. Come on, give me something else to spray, please. Come on. Does that have anything, any effect on you guys? No. Okay. I can get to that one from it. This is going to be a bit of a stretch. No, ah, ten seconds to spare is not too bad. Whoop, lost boost again. I have no idea how I'm cutting these days up, so if I haven't done an intro for this episode, hi. Ugh, oh, Tangle Wands. No, don't eat it! Oh, you git. Tangle Wands are just too valuable. They're like a hundred each. I should really go back and feed guys because I've been away for a while now. You know what I haven't seen in ages? A gold slime. They added a couple of uh, pods that contain gold plorts. Because you can now refine them into stuff, but I haven't seen a gold slime in ages. I'm beginning to think maybe I should have another teleporter it's deeper in so I don't have to trek back all the way to that one. Because that is a long trek. Alright, let's see who's ready to riot then. How much is the master apiary then? Ooh, 25 pink, 18 honey and 10 tangles. Just money wise that's expensive, using them for fabrication instead of for, uh, you know, profit. Have they increased the value of pinks? I thought pinks were like tier 0 or something but here they're more valuable than rocks at the moment. Because they're up and rocks are sort of neutral. They're not quite as much as them when they're up, but still, I thought pinks were worthless. And apparently they're on the same tier as rocks. Is that new? Or did I just never notice and just completely write pinks off? And can you really blame me? They're so common. Why not? So, yeah. Let, let me know in the comments if that was just something I missed or if that's a change. I haven't seen it in the change logs, but you never know. I can now afford the next one. I haven't quite finished the rounds, but I want to do this one. Slime Trophy 2. So I get Ultra Dash Boots for 47,000 and a couple of colours. Oh, it's on top of it. Is it still cracked? They're both cracked. Huh. I, I wish they weren't cracked, but I guess that's nice. Well, I should move these ones out of the way. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. So from down here, and only in that exact spot... Oh, God, where am I? Oh. And only in that exact spot do they sort of give it a halo. Okay, back to what I was doing. Now that's something I never quite realised. I don't know if that was a tweak in the description or if I just didn't read it, but that's, you know, just an apiary. That one has a higher chance of rare resources, and that has a very high chance of rare resources. So not only do they last longer and are better value for plorts, but they actually serve better for getting the higher end stuff. I didn't realise. So that's cool. So I think I'm going to save up for one of them, which means I'm going to have to not sell some tangle plorts I get. Um, what are you doing out? No. Get back in there. Naughty. How did he get out? We must have just bumped each other out when I fed them. Uh, stay. This is quite a view from up here. I'm looking for more of uh, these sort of third tier extractors. So I'm looking for pods in the desert. But just look at this view from up here. You can see the oases by their massive sort of domes. Oh! Hello! Oh, I'm so glad I decided to sort of talk about this area. Bloody hell. Oh. Oh. Well, I can put them in a thing, I guess. But yeah, you can see the, the oases by the the domes. What on earth is that tower? But yeah, ah, oh, so nice up here. And I cannot believe, I would not have found that, but at least it was only a gold plot one. 
So it's not like I would have missed one of the really rare react uh, extractors I was looking for. Oh, that's where the uh, Tangle Gordo was. I didn't realise it was a tower that big. I guess I didn't look up. That's an open pod, I think. Oh yeah, that's where I found the first extractor. The uh, Master Apiary. I wonder if I can actually get up there. I don't think I can because there's nothing even close to it. I'd love to, though. Love to scale that thing. It reminds me of the... Um, the Unseen University Tower from, like, Discworld. You'd like... Uh, or, or something like that, where you'd look out the window and there'd just be this giant tower going so high in the sky, higher than anything else around it. Oh, there's another one. They are just sneaky and high up. And it's going to be... Super Hydro Turret, an advanced defensive cannon that doubles the firepower against tar. Yeah. All right, then. And there's another one. Oh, wow, these ones are quite close together. Ooh. I'm going to go with... I don't think anything's going to fly out of it. There's a ledge too close. So drill. Pump. Master pump. Cool. Now how the hell do I get out of here? Seriously. Aha. There's a ledge across there. That you fly to... And then you can climb out. Nice. Oh! I'm behind the, the mosaic. Hello. I didn't want to check this place out, but I guess I'm here now. And it would feel silly leaving without searching a bit. No. No, I'm, I, I don't care how silly it feels. I'm saving it for when I popped the Gordo. Ah! Hello. On the Unseen University Tower, I was just about to head to the uh, teleporter. This is going to be the third one, isn't it? Oh, Towering Glass Sculpture. That's got to be a cool one, though, surely. Because you can tell if they're going to give you items by if there's a ledge around them. If there's no space for the items to land, then it's probably going to be uh, a recipe. Right. Bank those. And I guess I'm back to a bit of maintenance work. Um, what are you doing up there? Come here, come here. Stop jumping out. I think they do jump or something because... No. Because they do seem to end up outside this trough alarmingly often. Just stay put, please. This episode was probably longer than usual because I actually had to record it over the uh, period of like three separate recordings on three different days because I just kept cutting and cutting stuff out. And that's for two reasons. One, because, yeah, today, uh, like now, my daily routine is just the same thing you've seen a hundred times. But also because we're almost at day 100 and day 100 is going to be uncut you're going to see a full day of slime rancher to celebrate this game's re this, this this playthrough reaching 100 days so thank you very much for watching and i'll see you at 100